Everyone in the neighborhood fears Cleopatra and Queen Isabella. Even the bloods who used to run this neighborhood cower in fear because of that. At this point, over three-fifths of Hagerstown is considered their territory. They refuse to be spayed. Lately, they've really developed a catnip addiction. Lately, it's gotten really bad. We live in constant fear that Queen Isabella and Cleopatra will do damage to our house and bodies. They've begun to launder money. We're talking hundreds of millions of dollars. Last week, the cops showed up and arrested Francine and I. Needless to say, our cats have made our lives a living hell. Help, Help us, Jackson, Jackson Galaxy. Galaxy! I'm Jackson Galaxy. I'm a musician by night and a cat behaviorist by day. Wow. I've met cats with behavior problems, catnip problems, drinking problems, killing problems, and arson problems but never one that couldn't be reasoned with. Hi, welcome to our house. Wow, I'm surprised. Usually by now, Queen Isabella and Cleopatra have ripped the majority of the skin off our guests' faces. Wow, I'm surprised as well. I didn't expect your wife to be this attractive. Well, the reason they're leaving me alone is because I exude an air of confidence. Oh! What was that? Oh, <laughs> one of them got you. Yeah, they're pretty quick. Most of the time you can't even see them. Right now they're testing me. I'm standing my ground to make them know that no matter what they do, they can't- Oh! Oh! What was that? Oh! Ooh, that was definitely Queen Isabella. The next slash is her signature move. <laughs> Your cats have such bad behavior because they don't fear consequences. See, what do you do when Isabella flashes someone's neck? <laughs> we say no, bad kitty, and then run away and hide. See, I'm gonna offer them something they like, catnip, as a reward for them being good. <laughs> 